A pokey old camel lumbers through the heart of a modern city, Karachi. This is the contrasting picture of a growing new country, Pakistan. Created in 1947 by separating the Muslim regions of India from the Hindu, the new nation is located in two sections on the northwest and the northeast borders of India, which leaves east and west Pakistan divided geographically by 1,100 miles. The largest Muslim country in the world, two million of the republic's 87 million live here in Karachi. Once a great British port on the Arabian Sea, Karachi's harbor in West Pakistan is a sea terminus for three continents, Europe, Africa, and Asia. The cargo these workers are loading is salt, the third largest exporter of cotton. Pakistan also supplies 75% of the world's jute for making burlap. A strong military harbor, Karachi was the westernmost bastion of the Indian Empire. Modern planes, too, contribute to the economy of Pakistan. Hauling tourists or cargo, the planes place the nation only hours away from all the world markets. The many sides of Pakistan have made it a new fascination for tourists. In the same latitude as California, its gleaming beaches and mild water provide a perfect playground privacy off the beaten path. Most visitors of the fragile sex avoid a camel ride, but some folks must try everything once. They'll remember this ride. It'll be a sore subject with them for a long time. A smoother ride can be found on the Arabian Sea, where boating and deep sea fishing are excellent. In these historic waters, you feel the exotic spell of a faraway land but you also feel at home with hosts.